Hi there. So today I'm going to speak to you about the uh, bagpipe blowpipe valve, the non-return valve that prevents air from coming back through the blowpipe. These valves come in different variations. So I'll just go through the variations that are available in the market and explain slightly how they work. And uh, we'll start with the traditional non-return valve. So this is just a basic valve that uh, is attached to a copper staple and it's hemped onto your blowpipe. When you blow, it opens and closes, hence the non-return. So, so that's your standard non-return valve. The next valve I'm going to show you is the Little Mac valve or uh, also available from Bandspecker, the Little Valve. Now this was I think the, the, the first generation of plastic alternative valves to the traditional non-return valve and the principle here is it would fit or it fits into the uh, the bore of your blowpipe, just it fits in like this. And here again, it's a non-return valve. Now, the disadvantage with the Little Mac valve or the Little Valve, uh, where well, there are actually two, I would say, not every blowpipe has the correct bore size. In fact, most blowpipes don't have the correct blow, uh, bore size. I know for a fact that McCallum and uh, Henderson Hardy's that we sell uh, do not have the correct size, which means you would have to use a reamer, uh, one of these, we actually sell these, uh, and remove black wood or plastic. You might have a plastic blowpipe you want to use uh, for... Uh, for the purpose and remove wood or plastic in order to fit the blowpipe valve or the little valve. Uh, one of the disadvantages with that is that when doing this manually you don't always get a clean or a very clean uh, increased bore size so when the valve sits in here it's sometimes difficult difficult to get it a hundred percent airtight so that's an issue uh, another disadvantage i would say is that because the valve is actually being placed into the bore you're you're slightly reducing the the bore size so slightly more restriction here and i think another disadvantage i would say that this can fall out if it's not fitted properly. So those are things to remember if you're looking at the Little Mac valve. In more recent times, well, actually they've been around many years, uh, the market has sort of switched to the blowpipe stock valve. Uh, the first brand to come out was the Moose valve. Uh, it's available from Ross as a Ross valve and in recent times also available uh, from Bandspec as the Bandspec blowpipe valve. I'll use the Bandspec because it's a nice blue colour so it's good to demonstrate. Now this is style of valve, like I say, fits inside. I have this open stock here to show you blowpipe stock. Fits inside the stock. So they come with a tool uh, and using this tool you can fit the valve into the blowpipe stock. So you push down, reach where the uh, the middle is approximately, or take your blowpipe and push down to the required position. Once you've done that, you would use the tool just to tighten it slightly. Don't tighten it too, too much because depending on how dry your bagpipes are, 
the black wood, if you have a black wood stock, will expand slightly and uh, it might be difficult getting the, the blowpipe valve back out again. So that's how uh, this style of valve fits inside the stock. Now, the advantage there is that the, uh, the humidity or some of the spit will collect on the outside of this extension here. So it does act as a, as a, a type of uh, spit valve as well, I presume. But an advantage here is you can actually fit the water trap. If you have a look here, that's how you fit the water trap. Just make sure that you don't touch the ends here. So don't push the water trap in too far. Just have it pulled out slightly enough that it, so that it doesn't fall out of the uh, the stock, obviously, and that allows the valve to open and close. So similar to the uh, the other valves, it is a non-return valve, but just inside this mechanism, and to remove it. Just unscrew and pull out. I'll just show you the valve here. So that's how that works. This is the uh, this is a McCallum blowpipe valve. Uh, it's a stock valve, so this will fit to the bottom, the underside of the the stock. Just fit inside the bag and push in. And, uh, and this too acts as a non-return valve. Obviously, this is sat uh, inside the bag, so the disadvantage with this is you cannot fit a water trap of any kind because you're actually using uh, the, the space available uh, to fit the valve here. Uh, again, similar thing, it's a non-return valve. And uh, the advantage, I suppose, with this valve over the Little Mac valve and the non-return valve is uh, again, the moisture uh, and spit will uh, uh, collect around this extension here. So it does act as a, a spit trap. After playing, you can pour out uh, the, uh, the spit. So these are the different style valves. Uh, I hope this gives you a, a, an overview of what's available. If you have any questions, contact us. Uh, we're happy to help.